So to make a diagnosis of either chronic kidney disease or protein in the urine or nephrotic syndrome, which is just when the protein is very heavy and there's lots of protein in the urine, almost always you need to do blood tests and urine tests. As I said earlier, because very often patients don't have any symptoms, very often the diagnosis is just made through testing of the blood or the urine. The key tests for the urine involve testing whether there is any protein in the urine or whether there is blood and protein. And then this can be done initially through just what's called a dipstick test where a patient provides a urine sample and this can be tested straight away for the presence of blood or protein. Normal people don't have any blood or protein in their urine. Uh, this can sometimes then be quantified by sending it off to a lab to be able to measure exactly how much protein is in the urine. The blood testing is always needed in these diseases and there's a whole range of blood tests that might need to be done from looking just at the kidney function uh, to trying to identify the cause for the problem. But again, these are very straightforward blood tests that can be formed very simply, but some sometimes take a few days to come back. In some patients, there are more sophisticated tests needed. So very often you need some imaging, for example, an ultrasound scan of the kidneys, which is an extremely easy test, which takes about 15 minutes, with some cold jelly applied to the skin, and an ultrasound to look at the kidney size and shape. Occasionally people need other imaging, such as CT scans, but that's relatively unusual. And in some people, if there is a lot of protein in the urine, a kidney biopsy is needed, which is a test which almost always gives the answer but isn't needed in everybody. A kidney biopsy involves putting a small needle into the kidney and taking a small sample out to look at under a microscope with local anaesthetic and often an injection to make people very sleepy and is usually done as a day case procedure coming into the hospital in the morning, having a biopsy and being able to go home the same day. Not everybody needs a biopsy, and certainly if a diagnosis is of a chronic kidney disease, a biopsy is less often needed than if there's heavy protein in the urine or nephrotic syndrome, when very often a biopsy is needed.